It's you. Go away, child. Get out of my frame. In this video, we're gonna be talking to a creative genius. Now, you might be thinking, how many creative geniuses does this guy know? Well, I know many kids. And today we have a very special guest on the show. We're gonna be talking about creativity and inspiration and things like that, coming up. Hi everybody, my name is Yuri from The Magic Sauce and on this channel we bring you tools, tips, tricks, techniques and other stuff around innovation and creativity. Let me ask you a question. Who are the most creative people you know? I'll give you a little hint, they're usually a bit shorter than we are. Well in this case, my today's guest is not shorter than I am at all. We have a very special guest for this video. We're gonna be talking about creativity and inspiration. I'm gonna do a little Zach King magic trick here with this magic Ikea towel. As I do this, you need to sit down. <laughs> there you go, and now, this is my nephew, Matteo. Matteo is, how old are you? 14. 14? You didn't see that because of the introduction of this video, but he's actually taller than I am. That's what you get when you have lots of, well, it's not steroids, so it's milk. Milk. Lots of milk. We just spent a lovely week in uh, Bali. First time in Bali, right? Yes. Nice. That's where you got the uh, the Deus. Remember, I have a video with a hat that says yeah. Deus. What does Deus mean in Dutch? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> I don't have a clue. It means it means dork. <laughs> it does. You didn't okay. know that? No. He's a nerd. So I'm Dutch. He's also Dutch, but he's also half Czech. So it's half yeah. Czech, half Dutch. So when we speak to each other, which is hilarious, because his first language is Czech, my first language is Dutch. But when we yeah. speak. We speak English. We want to talk a little bit about creativity and rather than hearing from me. What is creativity to you? I use creativity like every day. Almost everything I do is just like drawing, animation. I think about like ideas for animation and things like that. It may sound funny, but I think about Minecraft. What I, what can I do in there? For yeah. the old people there, Minecraft is a video game. Yeah, what you can like build there. I usually think about that before I go to sleep. So. Matteo just talked about drawing. Uh, these are some of his drawings which I show over here. So this is one of his bits. Uh, that's another bit that he did and he posted them on his Instagram. And this is stuff you do in your free time, right? Yeah. Do you draw every day? Uh, like, yeah. If you want to draw better in future, you have to draw everyday sketch. And I made one drawing which came out very well and I drew it like 100 times. That's interesting because a lot of people think that drawing and creativity is this, you know, this kind of talent that's in you. What you're saying is you have to practice right yeah you have to anyone, anyone anyone can do it like in, in, in the time you're learning you can find your own style I still still didn't find mine so on my Instagram you can see like a lot of different styles where do you get your ideas from first like there are a lot of things I can do to get some inspiration I like can what? look look around me like the microphone is is having like funny shape I can make shit out of it or it's something idea, right? like this this could be like a cool tower or something. When I sketch, I usually just start with a circle. I have no idea what I want to draw. So I usually end up with like uh, 10 pages full of sketches. And then when something good, like something you like comes out, you can draw it like clean. But this is incredibly messy. Yeah. Right, so it's not It's perfect. not clean, no. But you're saying is you, it, it's gotta be messy first, right? Drawing is, is one kind of creativity, right? Yeah. So drawing is just one way to express creativity. Kids or young, like teenagers like you, are more creative than adults. Do you agree with that? They have like better mindset. They can like imagine things more, like things that adults wouldn't think about because they usually think about what they will spend their money on or mm -hmm. like okay. about usually money and life, but kids have free time and they can think about like, they watch cartoon, they like some character, they combine it with like other characters. The adult is usually like better in the technique, the drawing. The child is better in ideas. In the like imagination. Yeah, imagination and ah. fantasy. That's why. Uh, wh wh but why do you think that is? They have way more free time, so they have also like some time to draw something or just sketch. Right. Or Kids have a bit more free time, they got more headspace, and therefore their imagination can can go a bit can go a yeah. bit further. By the way, uh, this guy designed the first, the first the Magic Sauce skateboard. So if there's any skateboard makers, designer watching this, we have the family shielders have the copyright to this one. Can you draw anything? Like, no pressure, but you cannot make any mistakes. Just so you know. Okay. 
I'm gonna give him some uh, instructions and you need to draw it as fast as you can. So the first one is an angry penguin peeing against the wall. Go. It there you go, like there you go. Penguin, All right, yeah, but... see, yeah it's, it's an angry penguin. There's no right nor wrong on this channel. A jealous girl. Oh. Are those boobs? No. You're not, you're not supposed to draw <laughs> boobs. <laughs> those are eyes. Throwing a ball in the swimming pool in Bali. It has to show Bali. Okay. Clever, clever. See what he's doing there? When I don't know how to represent that's, Bali, I that's just... That's exactly what I do. So, so while he's drawing that, basically it's it's about not overthinking it. And if you've ever played the game Pictionary or any game for that matter, the whole thing is about not overthinking it. And I think creativity, even in a business setting, is a bit like that. Sometimes the best thing to do is if you're prototyping or you need to come up with a certain solution, do it rough and ready first, don't overthink it. And then once you have something, then you, because you could make this better later on if you yeah. wanted, right? I told you we we're gonna come up with a the Magic Sauce skateboard and I'm so, First of all, so proud of him, and it just looks amazing. So here's the, here's the skateboard that we're gonna have made. I don't have the skateboard yet, I'll get it made. We'll get one here on the show, I'll send him one as well. What is, what is, what is your one tip you would give to other people if they want to... You just know, just okay? draw every day and maybe you will, in the future, maybe you will be the most famous artist on the world. All right, so there you have it. Some wise tips from uh, the mini, the mini Shielders generation, the future of the Shielders family over here from my nephew, Matteo. I bet you if you keep following him, he'll be one of these great, amazing, funky, cool artists of the future. And you can then say, hey, I've been following this guy for like 10 years. Hope you are well wherever you are in the world. We'll catch you again very soon with another video. Hit all the buttons if you appreciate what we do. Share it with somebody who needs to see it. Leave us a comment if you want to see another type of video. And I'll catch you, yes you, in another video. <laughs> <laughs> That's not good.